Is Exit Lag Worth It? Full Review Though the worthiness of exit lag depends on individual preferences and needs, it can be very much worth it for users seeking improved gaming performance and reduced latency. And I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate you what I mean by that. So here's how we are going to do it. So first things first, I'm going to go ahead and redirect you here to my ping. As you can see, my ping right now is running from 120 to 140, and that is definitely not very much ideal. Now I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate you how you can definitely reduce that one using exit lag. So I'm going to go ahead, oh, there you go. It says there that that was, so the peak here is around 180. That is really high, everybody. Now I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate you again how to lower this one. So I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate you how to do that one by using exit lag. So first things first, we're going to go ahead and look for Roblox down here. After clicking on this, you will be redirected to this page right here. Now for the advanced routes, I'm going to go ahead and click this one and set the TCP to 2 and then click apply. As you can see, something appeared in here. Now once you're done doing that, I'm going to go ahead and click the optimize so this is going to give us the best performance available all right after doing so we're going to go ahead and click the apply routes in here as you can see it is red here but we haven't turned this on so make sure to turn this on all right there you go exit lag has detected roblox now we're going to go back to our roblox and we're going to reconnect this one now take note again that our ping usually is around 114 to around 140 and there was even a time earlier that it was around 180 so that definitely is very high now we're going to go ahead and try to see how this is going to go so we're going to wait for it a little bit to stabilize all right it's starting to reduce all right 90 and let's see if it is going to stay at 90 or even reduce lower than that. Alright, so now you can see that it is lower by around 10. And yep, that's basically how you're going to do it, everybody. So that 20 is going to give you a very much significant changes. So congratulations, everybody. That answers your question. Is exit lag worth it? It definitely is, everybody. And this is applicable not only for Roblox, but to all other games possible. So you're just going to go ahead and look for your games in here. Say, for example, if you're going to play CSGO or Counter-Strike 2, you can definitely click this one here and then change the region to the recommended. Go ahead and click the advanced routes and set the TCP and the UDP to 2 and then hit apply. Once you're done doing so, go ahead and optimize and then apply the routes. Congratulations, that is definitely how you are going to do it. And if you are interested in using exit lag, go ahead and click the link in the description box or the comment section for you to start with your 3 days of free trial. As always, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if it helps you out.